Hey guys, it's me, Cruel, back again with another action video on this channel, and welcome to all of the Lockies once again. Today we have part 3 of the Secret Picnic Party, and uh, I decided to actually make these one episode per reaction, so I will be reacting to episode 3 today, and then we will make separate videos for 4 and 5. Uh, I just thought it was easier, you know, for people to understand what I'm reacting to, because a lot of people probably uh, thought I only react to part 1, or to episode 1, in my last one, and um, it's partly due to me not being able to put both uh, thumbnails in there. And I really like the thumbnails they have for this, these videos. They're really funny. So I kind of want to just kind of, you know, how do I say that? Respect that and have those thumbnails in there. And that's why I'm just making single videos. There's no specific reason. I will still get to these quite soon, uh, I believe. So yeah, let's get into part three. Last time we ended on um, Ginny and Lea finishing their shopping, if I remember correctly. So. Yeah, here we go. If you're new to the channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button under the video. I have daily cape operations on here, and I will leave a playlist with all of my secret number rations in the comment section as well, which is basically everything. You know, I've reacted to all kinds of covers, dance performances, uh, music videos, and so on. The only thing I have not done is live performances on YouTube. I have reacted to one or two on um, Patreon from them. I remember I watched one uh, Who This performance when it happened back in the day, like which is almost a year. It's kind of a year ago now, right? Um, and another one, I don't remember which one though, but yeah, if you want to see those as well, you can request, but I will be reckoning on Patreon due to copyright on YouTube, sadly. Big shout out to my Patreon lineup of July as well. Special shout out goes out to Forger at Nami Servants, GoFolf and Reese Rowler. Thank you guys so much to all of you though. Let's get it. Uh, part three. Let's see what happens today. Probably the cooking, right? It's a nine minute video. So give me all the cooking today. And Jeannie's going to be so happy that she doesn't have to. <laughs> That's my, that's my assumption, my expectation here. One last thing I want to say is, it's really fun to watch them. It's so, so fun. Uh, some people under my episode one and two uh, picnic party ration said, they're like friends. They're, you know, like you feel like you're part of them. And I agree with that. It's really, really fun to just watch their daily life. Like, it's, it's just, it's not, like, there's other groups that are also fun to watch. Like, I'm thinking of Mamamoo or 21. I've watched a lot of content from, a lot, in a way, uh, BTS as well. But they're all kind of, like, really, really fun, but in different ways. And Secret Number has such, such a unique charm about them, and they're so chill. Like, even under, under each other, like, they're still rookies, in a way. To me, they're kind of still rookies. I think they passed their one-year anniversary by now, but, I mean, they did, I know, but... Still, you know, to me, they're kind of rookies, and it's crazy to see how chill they are. Like, how almost veteran they are in their personality. It's cool to see, for sure. I sure, <laughs> sure hope they grow more. <laughs> Wait, they don't show the cooking? Oh, decoration. Oh, oh yeah. True. It's true. <laughs> Honestly, I love the dresses, and I would say, just be there enough decoration. You're pretty. Holy moly, especially Leah, looks so good right now. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, okay, okay. Cookie. Oh my god, Sudam is so cute. With the Sodi? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, Sudam was rice balls, right? <laughs> Let's get it. Oh, back to, back to them. True. N Wait, no, don't tell me they actually make the whole secret number. No, oh, poor them. That's so many letters. Wait, H? Yeah. Oh, it's happy. <laughs> happy watch? One million? <laughs> the letters are flow, like, <laughs> drifting away. <laughs> Hey, you. 
If hey, if Ginny is complaining now, she wanted to do it. <laughs> she loves to complain, though, right? Relatable. Mm. You? Oh, it's an O, right? No, you. <laughs> okay. Oh, washing everything. Rice cake. Let's see how topoki is made. I have no idea what that is, honestly. Like, I don't know how it's made, I don't know what it is. <laughs> I only heard hear the name all the time. Is it chili? <clears throat> I kind of want to try cooking this. Hmm. <laughs> oh, Capri said, right. I hope there's some. I sure hope there's some meat in there. Some. At least some. Come on. I don't think there is. <laughs> I know some Capri salad has meat, right? I think. Like, like, not like crazy meat. I mean, like uh, chicken or something. Um, is it chicken? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, like sliced chicken or something. Like a little bit. I, I think that's in some Capri salad, and I I like those. Maybe that's named differently though. Hmm. <laughs> See. All all day. That's like the the fried food they make. The fried chicken. There's a lot of spice. Really? That's good to know. <laughs> Doesn't have to be the, the whole table, that's fine. Oh, it says thank you. That's cute too. Mm. It looks cute. All the questions. <laughs> you know what I love about this moment here? I love how Leah is just not bothered whatsoever. She's like, every day, man. <laughs> She's just... <laughs> she just keeps talking about delivery food. And... <laughs> Scissoring that stuff. Both? Both? I didn't get that, sorry. Tita, <laughs> Tita, <laughs> okay. So she's similar to Sudam there, right? Sudam said that with fried chicken, if I remember correctly. What, what was the Tita? Oh my god, I'm gonna. It's Tita. My bad. Oh, but too much. <laughs> oh, she hid it from like managers? 
뭐? 먹고 있는데 지나간 거지 그 앞에를. 헐, 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 이렇게 먹다가 어? 던졌어. <웃음> 대박. 아 던졌지? 저는 저는요 연습실 안에서 그 아이스크림을 먹고 있었는데. 이제 트레이닝 룸. 들어오시는 거야. 응. 직원 분이 그 까는 거 앉았어. <웃음> 아나 주머니에 넣은 적도 있어 아이스크림. <웃음> 어떻게 머리에 넣었어? 아이씨. 근데 그때 당시는 그거 하나로도 되게 목숨을 걸잖아. 그렇지. 엄청 네. 연습을 너무. That's kind of it's kind of interesting, right? Isn't it how it's the same with with uh, little children? I'm not trying to compare that with little children too much, but um, you always say like, if you forbid something to children, they will just do it more, right? They're more likely to do it, or they just want to do it more because it's forbidden. So it's kind of like that with them, right? They're like, you do, you can't eat that, you can't eat that, you can't eat that because you can't gain calories too much, but then they just want to do it more. So isn't there like a similar learning thing from even like the company side and the industry in general that has to be learned there? Whereas they would allow things, basically eat everything you want as long as you make, I don't know, the criteria at the end of the week or something. And if you don't make it, you get a punishment or something like that. I don't know. But at least then it, it's not forbidden to eat something, right? Because it always feels like they actually forbid to eat certain things. But maybe that's just like, like maybe that's a result of what I just suggested. Maybe it was like that before, and trainees, granted, are teenagers too, and they can't control how much calories they actually eat. They don't know how much an ice cream has and so on. They don't know the the exact effect of everything they eat. So it's kind of like pr to protect their health and their, especially their weight. Um, there's I guess the the forbidden of of like certain food. Um, what's the right word for that? Not forbid. I mean, stupid. <laughs> but they block you. They forbid you from eating certain food because they know you can't calculate it yourself. I think that might just be a result of it. So it's a hard topic for sure. But it's kind of similar to what how children work, right? It's forbidden. You just do it even more. <laughs> 도랭이? 음. 도랭이. Wait, she has to make them now when it's really hot. Oh boy. 뭐? Hey, the lead. Leak. Sorry. 그 아보카도 씨 아까 뺀거 여기 안에 딱 가운데. Oh, this is the. 이거 갈색을 변하잖아요. 오. 이거 넣으면. Oh, that's smart. Wow. I'm assuming because it absorbs something. Oh. He's literally making the rice. <laughs> oh, it's with seaweed or, or what? Oh. I think it was seaweed that they mixed it with. Mozzarella cheese. Oh, it's the rice cakes. Okay. Looks really good though. The taco? <laughs> Wait, what? Topically time for fr Oh, they're making french fries too. I didn't even... They didn't have that on a list, I think. It was a picture, but I didn't think they, they chose it. Seasoning. Wait, she puts it... Oh, in interesting. This is just... Oh, this is actually really cool at here. So I'm assuming she puts... Uh, it was it pepper, I believe? In her hand, in case she overspills it too much, and then it's only in her hand. So if you don't do that, if you just put it in the pan, it can happen that uh, too much comes out, and then it's already in the pan. You can't... Like, it's harder to get out of the pan. You, you still can, depending on the food, but it's harder than just not... Like, just putting it from uh, your hand, right? Oh... 
That's smart. I never thought about that. I really didn't. It's not often imp like important, I think. That's not many. <laughs> oh, she made more, okay. okay. But I guess it's the side dish, so they don't need that many, I guess. What I'm more worried about is the french fries are in an open basket, right? You have eight cold french fries because they will turn cold really fast. Not tasty. <laughs> I'm worried about that, but hey, not our problem, I guess. Looks good, though. Looks good, especially the Capri salad. Thank you. Oh, all the questions. That looks so cool. Nice. So pretty. <laughs> that, that was really quick. <laughs> okay. So I was thinking how would they make such a phone call in like the 20 seconds we had left of the episode because I just saw it's it's almost over. <laughs> and I was like, okay, I guess we get a shocking end. Or like in, in the midst of the, the phone call, they end the episode here. <laughs> but now they just literally asked, are you coming soon? We're hungry. Bye. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I mean, I guess it works, but man, whenever I take up a call, if I'm called or if I call people myself, it's never this quick. I literally just want to say one thing, but it's never this quick because either me or the other person just bursts out talking about other stuff. It always be like that, man. Sometimes it's annoying as well if you're not the person that wants to necessarily talk very long in that moment. But anyway, that is my reaction to episode three of the secret picnic party um that was cute I, I i really like how denise did that with the seasoning i, I know it's a really minor thing but honestly I, i'm gonna i'm gonna actually do that too whenever it's needed right but sometimes it's not that needed but it is very handy at times like especially if i think about like really uh, spicy seasoning like chili for example chili powder or something or even garlic powder or something right like that's both stuff that you can't put too much in. Sure, chili powder, I don't personally mind if it's a bit too much because I can handle spicy food very easy. But garlic powder, if you put in too much by accident, mm, I don't know about that, man. That's way too strong then. Like, I do like garlic, but not too much, right? It's not something you need much of for, for um, a dish. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. See you back in episode 4, which will probably come out soon. I really love watching this, and it's, it's really fun to record them as well, so... Um, I just recorded episode 1 and 2 like 2 or 3 days ago, max, so this is coming out probably a week later than episode 1 and 2 uh, from the way I schedule it, but I already record it now, so a few days before it even comes out, just because I really, really like watching this right now. It's just so fun, you know, and it's a bit sad to know that there's an end in sight, you know, we only have two more episodes of this. They're gonna be really fun though, you know, the Q&A questions, I'm looking forward that, to that a lot. Like a lot, a lot. So I hope you are as well. And if you are, make sure to check back with episode 4. See the next video, either in episode 4 or in another reaction video. Who knows? And yeah, that's it for me. Peace.